Many Magic the Gathering fans ask, is it worth my money to buy Time Spiral Remastered? Well, I'm not the professor. <laughs> so, we're still going to open up a box. So, uh, yeah. Let's just uh, do the thing. Uh, there's that number so you can go and uh, trace it. Uh, Termogoyf probably damaged this box already with its resealed looking package already. Looking all floppy. Ooh, I got that three stuffy doll. I think someone said if there's three on the top, then your box is a flop. Okay, cool. My box is a flop. So, um, right now we're just going to be looking for some... Good old fashioned old school foils. Let's see. And ooh. First pack, first mythic, gauntlet of power. And a lava spike with a night token. I'm just going to track the rares, the mythics, and the old school. I'm really looking more forward towards the sliver tokens, if anything, not going to lie. Boom, 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 and that's our commons. Not really going to go slow for the commons or the uncommons, but uh, Cloud Key. And a Knight of the Reliquary with a Kobold of Kerkeep. So this is actually a misprint from what I was told. It's actually supposed to read Cobalt of Kerkeep because this is the card that produces it. Uh, a little bit of fun info for you. I like to keep things fun. The um, reason why I'm not going through really the commons and uncommons, I've, a lot of people are getting their hands on these. Uh, Going to be a very fun set to draft. Hope you guys are at home maybe able to draft or do something with your friends at least. <laughs> Also, another fun fact, this monster right here is a Mind Slicer. Uh, very awesome card. Uh, Porphyry Nodes is the rare with a Sigil of the Empty Throne. Well, that, that purple is really just nice. And uh, I guess I got some damage on it. Well, what do you expect? I dropped the box. You know, so... What is it, 412 cards in the set? Oh, wow, all of these are going to have some damage. That's the pouring token. You really got it. Ooh, poor free nodes. Foil. We got us a foily boy with a courser of crucifix. And our rare is the Sarah Avenger. I'm just going to go through these real quick. Kind of disappointed that I went and I dropped the box, probably damaging all my cards. You no, know, that's not... Yeah, there's going to be some damage. My insect token. Oh, another foil. Not really concerned with that foil, but Shriek Maw. Shriek Maw. And our re reiterate <laughs> as our rare. A lot of slivers in this set. That's probably what I'm most excited for. Uh, the only thing that they're not putting back is, I guess, the metallic sliver. Uh, Sliver Queen's on the reserve list, so, uh, you know, um, Sliver Hive Lord and Overlord would have been nice, but they're not part of the, uh, block, so, you know, can't have that. And our rare, Walk the Aeons, nice. Uh, let's pop that over in the rare with our Timu Battle Rage, and our Rage token. Still no Sliver tokens, um... You know, as far as with all the slivers that they added, there's not many sliver tokens. Um, you would think there would be more, but there's really not. Paramount Force with our Vesuvian Shapeshifter and a Bajuka Bog. Not too bad. So, so far, no sliver tokens. One Mythic. We already got our Foil Rare. You know, all that fun stuff. Oh, there we go. Metallic Sliver. Look at that. That's nice. Metallic Sliver. Um, 
was actually part of the, I want to say Tempest. It's a cloud with a little lightning bolt. Uh, it's an artifact. One to, one to cost for a 1-1. One, one. Yeah, it's still a cool slur. It's just, you know, I guess they just turned them into a token. Oh, let's see what we got here. These are the commons. One, two, three. We've got a flagstones so that needed a reprint. And we got some relentless rats for our time shifted and a Kavu primer. They bought Kavu's back. That's kind of cool. I might be pronouncing that wrong. Kavu, maybe. You know. Uh, I'm kind of hoping to see a silver legion. Let's say assembly worker. Ooh, fit of the lost. And we have Drawn You the Witch Lord. And that's kind of cool. Simeon Spirit Guide, I heard, was already banned. Just because it's an exile from the hand card for a free mana. Uh, probably get your commanders out super quick. Which is pretty cool. Yep. Yeah, um, I'm planning on drafting this uh, with one of my friends. Um, we'll both do a deck with specifically cards just from this set. Um, I'm going for a sliver deck, obviously. So having a sliver legion would be nice. We got uh, Venser, uh, Prize the Malgon, and the Goblin. All right, winding down the first third of the box. Uh, let's see what we got. We're going to go Blet and Spider. We got a two-headed slivery boy, Foil. And we have an Ancient Den. Following our Pact of the Titan. That's a rare. All right, cool. The art's really well done. I wasn't around for the time spiral block. I remember specifically the entire block. I was like, I you know, I really hated the transition from the old style art cards, like the way the the old style cards went. Oh snap! Okay. Um, but yeah, I really did not like the old style art. Sorry. Like, changing and shifting into what we have today. So, um, pretty much, I, I kind of went on hiatus. And then the next set, I forget which one was it, Future Sight, I want to say? So Future Sight had this weird thing with the border. And then it had, like, the, the casting cost was moved over to here. And I, I really hated it. And I just stopped playing completely. And I was like, you know what, I'm done. <sighs> there we go. Uh, who uses it? That's a spicy meatball. Or if I was, uh, Joey, bing, Sliver Legion. That's great. Gauntlet of Power and a Sliver Legion. Both something that I hope I get in the draft, because I would love to put, put that in a Sliver deck and just annihilate with a Restoration Angel. All right. Only two so far for Mythic. Um, not too bad. Um, we're still chasing those, um, Old foily boys. So we're going to go to right here like this. One, two, three. We got a hive stone. Perfect for slivers. We got a bent. Ooh, look at that. Mm. Look at that path to exile. And a uh, little bit of a Pringle. I hate to say it might be just my fault because my dumb ass decided to drop the box like I did. But uh, Path to Exile is... Ooh! Oh, hello. So, um, looking at this, this is definitely a miscut. It's, well, not miscut. It, yeah, it's miscut. It's off-center. It's really off-center. Yeah. I guess I'm looking for crimps and off-centers now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm just going to put that to the side. I didn't even notice any of those. I like that. Ooh, wait, what? Wait, you see that, right? Harmonic Sliver? Harmonic Sliver? I got two of the same cards in the pack. I don't think that usually happens, but that's pretty cool. We got a Mega of the Moon for our rare. And some secret plans. That, uh... That Path to Exile is pretty spicy. I'm not going to lie. Maybe if we're lucky, we'll see a uh, maybe a second Foily Boy. Um, maybe a Foil Kiki-Jiki. Metallic Sliver. 
Well, foily boys are metallic or lightning axe. Uh, looks like we got Molten Ring, uh, Joyra, the key to. Let's see, we got one, two, and three. All right. I'm actually excited that I got that Sliver Legion. I was thinking of buying one. I really do want, like, the uh, the promo. Ooh, that is beat up. Look at that. That token is Garbo. Ooh, Paradoxal Outcome. At least this one stayed in good shape. Followed by our Tomb Stalker. Nice. All right. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Da, 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 da. And return. This is, is this the new ongoing occurrence? Like, the last one was a sliver. Return to dust. Fearless Devourer. Return to dust. I don't, I don't know what's going on here. That's that's the second time in a row. Maybe it means that there's a duplicate Sliver Legion or Gauntlet of Power in my uh, box. Or maybe it's saying, you know, doubles, like Double Trouble. Big whammies. Liliana's Triumph. That would have been nice to get as a foil. Uh, we got uh, Angel of Salvation. And we're going to go Shaper, Order, Nitrate Assassin. Okay, cool. I'm going to try to speed it up. I'd like to keep this uh, under 15 minutes. Far seek. And we got our extra papriate. Here it is again. Fury Sliver. Fury Sliver. Stormcloud Dijin. Okay. Um, it's just, it's just kind of like, it's like, yeah, I love slivers, but, uh, you know, do I really need the same card right behind each other or right after each other? Let's see, we got us a goblin. This is an ugly goblin, but I do like the art. I feel like they're getting us ready. Uh, Valent Oddity Ford, uh, Dungeons and Dragons, maybe. Um, SRAM, the senior artificer. I, I feel like that's spelled wrong. I don't know. Summoner's Pact. We got an Imperiosaur, Fearless is the Power, and an Imperiosaur. This is this is an ongoing trend that I'm I, I don't like. I mean I'm stammering, but I don't I don't like it. I don't like the fact that I'm seeing the same card minus the same card. And maybe like I didn't notice it before, but as the packs like wind down, I'm noticing uh, Prime Evil Titan. Ooh, Prime Evil Titan. When nature calls run. <laughs> I'm gonna start using that when I go to the bathroom. Well, but you know, when Nature Carls gotta run. I feel like Jimmy Neutron got a blast. Slaughter Pact. It seems like we're getting all the packs. Let's see, Basalt. And, oh, it didn't do it. It did not do it this time. I guess I broke the curse. I guess we're not going to be seeing another Sliver Legion or another uh, Gauntlet of Power. But I still haven't seen any more uh, Mythics. So two Mythic Box is kind of... Mortified. Oh, yeah, I'm kind of mortified. Here's the Heartwood Storyteller. We got the Kavu, Stronghold Rats, and the Yixlid Jeller for the Uncommon 3. Yeah, I guess it was just, like, right there. Oh, so, I know this is, like, off-topic and stuff. I was reading about how, a while back ago, um, the promo Gaia's Cradle was actually in Urge's Destiny in the Uncommon slot. You can actually look that up. Uh, I actually... Ooh, hold on, hold on. So we got Spider. Our Walk the Aeons foil. So we got two foil rares. Beast Within and a Tomb of Yawgmoth. Nice. But yeah, so apparently it was that and it was two other promos. And uh, the promos were actually inserted in the Uncommon slot of Urza's Destiny. Now, I'm kind of thinking that, you know... There could still be some boxes out there with some promo cards in them. Oh boy, I hope that people aren't watching this. You know, my one or two viewers that will probably see this and will start buying up Urza's Destiny going, Oh, you know. This, ooh, there's Panhamarnicon. Nice. Yeah, uh, just so you know, I do have like a slight speech impediment. So, I, you know, getting things wrong, you know, that's kind of what's going to happen. I'll, I'll miss, you know, say some names and stuff like that but yeah panharmonicon's nice we got a foil path of exile uh the pouring we got a watcher sliver 
That's cool. Ooh, young pyromancer. And there's our boy. Here's our Termogoyf. It is not the one on the box. I'm disappointed, but, you know, I get it. But you know what? There's our Goyf. Same box. Sliver Legion and Goyf. And then we got our three uncommons. I'm going to keep looking to see if I keep seeing that. Three, three, three. And that brings us to our last third of a box. I'm going to just assume that, you know, this is going to be like maybe a four mythic box with a one foil trinket mage. With one foil. Sudden spoiling for another rare. We got one prodigal pyromancer, some rats, and a necrotic. Pretty cool. A bunch of these. I guess I'm not keeping it under 15 minutes here. That's a pouring. We have Treasure Cruise, non-foil, and Kirkheap. See, Kolbertolds of Kirkheap. That's what those uh, were supposed to be. But you know what? It wasn't. It just was misprinted as Cobalt. Time Bender. That's what I need. I need a Time Bender. Let's see what we got here. We got a goblin, ugly goblin. We got a hollow one. And we have Safi's Eric's daughter. And some. Pth, 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 pth. I can't pronounce it, so. Pth, 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 pth. And Crows and Grip. Nice. But yeah, pth, 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 pth. I've heard what used to be like an expensive card, even though it's an uncommon. Uh, apparently, it was really good. But uh, for that casting cost, it's, it's a little questionable. Alright, so let's see what we got. We have another, there's the kobold. These kobolds are pretty cool. I like them. We got a Shaper Parasite. We have our Epic Experiment. We have our Kravec. And then Necrotic and Slave and Shivens. Ooh, we have Veashina Shaman. That's cool. They brought back some Veashinos. That's, I think the first time I saw Veashino was Mirage. Maybe, I think. I don't I don't know. It's okay, though. All right, we got a knight. We got a foil. It is a cutthroat of ill doll. A little bit of writing there. Oops, Solven scrying. Nice. And our rare, Jaya Ballard, the task mage. And our three, bonded fetch. <laughs> bonded fetch. He's dumb. I would keep him as a pet, like a little Mike Wazowski-looking thing. Alright, supporting our Lingering Souls, not too bad, and our Greater Gargadon as our rare. One, two, and three. Ooh, a, a charcuterie sliver. No, it's a quarterie. I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it. And we're getting down to our one, two, three, four, five, six, our last six packs. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed this with me as we went through it. Um... I had a lot of fun opening this for you guys. Our team ascendant. Packed a negation. There we go. There's our packed. I guess this is a packed box because I've seen a lot of packs. Some guides and some. Yeah. Let's see what we got here. We're going to go Griffin. Ha, there we go. There's our non foil pack. And a Teleria West, which is nice. Um. Pithithist, some salt blasts. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. I feel like some of these cards are off-center. Well, as long as there's no, uh, you know, Land of our Elves. We got an Arch of Azraka, Mages of the Future. And our three, our Scrib, our Dune Rider, and our Storm Entity. Nice. Let's see what we got. Oh, we got another sliver. Passed in flames. And a Vesuva. Love me Vesuva. That'll bring us to four mythics. And then we have the Ixlid, Drudge of Grief, and our Celestial Crusader. Along with... That is off-center. Look at these boys. That is off-center. So is this one.
Nothing crimped. But, uh, wow. Those are some authentic boys right there. Let's see. Assembly worker. We got our reflex slivers, our foil. We have a contingent clasp. And a draining walk. Scrib. Stone cloaker. Skittering monstrosity. That is a nice art. Not gonna lie. I do like that. Alright, and our last pack. I was kind of hoping for a fifth mythic, but it looks like it's not gonna happen. Uh, let's wind down, and we're gonna go soldier. Anger the gods. Of course, I'm angering the gods with Arata. All right, and our last three uncommons with a dark heart sliver. And there we go. Well, thanks, guys. I hope if you found this informative or anything, give it a like, share it with your friends, subscribe to my lame ass. Sometimes I do more box openings. Sometimes I go on this and I just waste my money. So give it a check. Peace.